All right, ladies and gentlemen, we got a bit of a emergency recording for y'all because I came home and found out that the internet money wallet sacrifice phase was in fact live. You'd think I would have known given that I'd interviewed uh, one of the co-founders about three times. But folks, look, uh, I want to make a video just kind of breaking down what's going on and my thoughts on this. So folks, like, subscribe, click all the buttons, all the usual. So ladies and gentlemen, to put things very simply, Internet Money Wallet Dividend is a wallet very similar to MetaMask that plans on redistributing the fees the wallet collects through swaps within the wallet back to its token holders. Very simple idea, not reinventing the wheel, not some metaverse play building uh, skyscrapers in space that tracks your steps. All right, this is not, this is true DeFi in my opinion. And so because I've been read the founder and like the idea, I have personally uh, decided to participate in sacrificing for freedom of time. Where if you go to internetmoney.io, I'll leave a link down in the description below, and you uh, copy this address here, and you go to a wallet that you have the private keys to, meaning not on exchange, basically, for example, MetaMask wallet, and if you send either any of these cryptocurrencies from any of these chains, to this wallet right here, ending in 2001, uh, then you will get uh, sacrifice points. Just to clarify here, uh, what are you sacrificing for? The freedom of time and an act of free speech. Like-minded community members may show their support for the idea that all humans are entitled to their time. So that is what we're sacrificing here. Uh, for this sack, this wallet will be launching on Ethereum and BNB. Uh, so you will be uh, collecting fees from those chains and you will also receive FWD, which represents potential tokens that may launch on future EVM chains, such as Phantom, for example, Avalanche, for example. And if you participated in the Pulse chain uh, sacrifice phase, you will also get credit for this sacrifice uh, phase as well. Uh, so, folks, um, they're looking to raise uh, just about $12 million, uh, but because of the previous Pulse Chain sacrifice and the credit that those people are getting, uh, they're actually raising roughly about $10 million. Now, currently at the time of recording, if we check ETH Plor here and just quickly refresh the page, uh, they seem to have raised $170,000. Uh, at the time of recording, and again, they're looking aimed to raise about 10 million uh, before Pool A is capped off. Uh, after uh, Pool A hits 10 million dollars, then Pool B will open. Uh, we're up to 10% of WD and F FWD uh, will be available in that pool. So Pool A, uh, you you get a better rate, uh, but there is that potential for Pool B. Um, so yeah, folks, look, that's what's going on. Let's, let's check uh, Etherscan here to see if Etherscan has uh, anything different. Okay, now it says uh, according to Etherscan, we've raised uh, roughly 144,000. So basically, at the time of recording, uh, about an hour or so after the sack phase uh, began, it looks like we're just under $200,000 uh, from what I'm seeing. Uh, KG and Internet Money is live on YouTube as well. They probably will be for the people who managed to catch this uh, video uh, early. Uh, and so, folks, yeah, look, th this is what's uh, this is what's going on here. Look, I, I just got to clarify. Number one, guys, not financial advice. I am not a financial advisor. None of this is investment, trading, or advice of any kind. I'm just a random dude on the Internet. There is plenty of risk when it comes to crypto and investing in general. So do your own research. I'm not a financial advisor. What I am telling you is that I like this idea. I like the idea of sacrificing for freedom of time. So I've personally chosen to participate in this. And uh, folks, yeah, I'll leave links for all the relevant uh, links down in the description below. Like and subscribe, folks. And until next time, take care.